Welcome back to Andy's Guides. In today's video, we are going to show you how to fix FC24 DirectX error. Let's begin. Now, the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time on EI, click on the Create Account option. And from here, just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. Now, the DirectX error code FC24 in games typically indicates an issue related to DirectX, alright? A set of APIs used for multimedia tasks such as gaming and video playback. But don't worry because we got you covered. Here are some steps you can take to try to solve this error. Number one is, you need to update the graphics drivers because as we all know, Outdated or corrupted graphics drivers can cause DirectX errors. Update your graphics drivers to the latest version available from the manufacturer's website. If you're using AMD or Intel, just go to the website. But since I'm using NVIDIA, I just need to go to the GeForce Experience and download the uh, game ready drivers, install, and try to restart it to see if that works. Now, the next option is I need you to go to the device manager. Press the window button plus R to uh, run this dialog box and from here type in devmgmt.msc and click on OK. And I need you to go to the graphics driver uh, section which is going to be this one. Right, so I'm going to click on the display adapters, right click on the uh, this one. You can scan for hardware changes, right? Nothing happens. Or you can also click on the properties. And from here, you can choose to uh, update the driver by yourself or click on the update driver and click on OK. So you can search automatically for drivers or you can browse your computer for drivers. But if you click on the search automatically for drivers, you can search for updated drivers on the Windows Update. Click on that and to see if there's any update available. Now, the next option after this one, please, this is very important, is to go here. You need to go to the DirectX and user runtime web installer. And from here, just select the language you're comfortable with. Click on download to see if the version that you have is the most updated. All right. And try to restart to see if that works. Now, if none of the above solutions work, it's possible that you need to contact the support team for the game you are travel playing with. They may have additional troubleshooting steps or patches to address this issue, alright? Thank you so much for watching. We will see you in the next video.